What's up, YouTube? Zombie Kangaroo here with another Photoshop tutorial on how to give your photos a different kind of burn effect, like a vignette effect. What a normal vignette is, is I'm just going to open, share this one. And a normal vignette is when you take the gradient and you turn it to black to transparent, and you pretty much just draw a circle out just like that okay so it burns the edges on this one what we're actually doing is um no on this one what we're actually doing is changing the colors of the outside as we burn in it'll be quick and sweet so let's go ahead and open our original image which I have no idea where it's at um right there alright so I snap this picture. Can't even do that. Exit out of that, and then let's try it again. All right. How I got this picture? Uh, <laughs> me and a couple friends got bored, so we went all over Chambersburg, Pennsylvania, to find a dirt hill to walk up. And it was a pretty decent dirt hill. So I took a picture as Forrest was walking up in the suns and the clouds. Just made this picture. I used this picture in so many different projects. And won't be any different from this one. So the first thing you want to do is create a new layer. And choose the gradient tool and make sure your colors are set to default. On the gradient picker thing, I guess, you want to... Make sure the second option is selected, your foreground to transparent, and then hit OK. And then radial gradient and opacity 100 and reverse. Make sure reverse is checked or you will go from the inside down. We want to go from the outside in. But anyhow, start from the middle, click and drag to one of the corners. And then that gives you your regular burn effect. Now what you want to do is change the blending mode to overlay. And that starts to brighten up the color and everything. Now what you do is just duplicate this vignette layer a few times until you get a really good color that you want. So you can go as far in as you want. And that looks about good to me. And then after that, create another new layer. Go to image, apply image and hit OK. That will make whatever is visible into one layer. So you can delete all the layers below that. Okay, and then so you got this image here. This already looks pretty good, but if you want to get extra credit, go to select color range. And then what I want to do is this blue is the exact blue that I want it, but this yellow is kind of faded, so I want to turn it a little bit maybe orange or a little bit darker orange so since it is yellow you can select yellows then it'll show you what come what will be selected right here hit OK now you probably won't see any of it actually selected you might see a few dots depending on what you're working with but go to image adjustments hue and saturation then colorize bring the saturation way up and then you just move the hue to that really orange that I wanted right there darken it up or lighten it up whatever you prefer okay and the final thing to do is or at least what I did is to crop it and crop and there is your vignette burning I call it um yeah, that's pretty much it if you have any tutorial suggestions feel free to comment and uh see you later